10 Things the Rich Do That the Poor Don't A lot of people wonder, in a world of average people and average salaries, how do rich people become rich? I mean who doesn't dream of becoming wealthy, so they can stop working, go on wild shopping sprees and take endless vacations? Living and enjoying every moment of life without worrying about money. However, when building their wealth rich people avoid most of these things which is how they build and maintain their wealth. The rich understand how money works, and instead of living a life of careless spending, which will quickly drain even a wealthy person's bank account, live for long-term financial independence and wealth. The self-made rich aren't the smartest people on the planet, they are people who have mastered some important principles that help them accumulate wealth and stay rich. Most importantly the rich treat wealth as a learnable skill and develop habits that help them in maintaining their wealth. 1. Rich people read books. While the poor people are enjoying themselves watching Netflix and other programs on TV, the rich are always learning new things by educating themselves, gaining new knowledge, and trying new things that they couldn't do before. You should note that reading books don't mean romantic novels or fictional books. As these are books for pastime and not books to gain knowledge on how to become rich. The rich read books that will bring them closer to accomplishing their goals, a good example is The Richest Man in Babylon which is a good book for those that want to increase their wealth. By reading books, the rich broaden their knowledge and increase their ability to gain more wealth. 2. Rich people have a financial growth mindset. While the poor see obstacles, the rich see stepping stones. This is possible because wealthy people are incredibly creative when it comes to thinking about business and finding different ways of making money. The rich set themselves apart from the poor because they nurture a financial growth mindset, helping them view money differently, and seeing profitable opportunities where the poor cannot. This abundance mindset helps successful and wealthy people believe there's always more money to be made even if they are already making money. By exploring new ideas and bigger projects, the rich get richer while the poor who is comfortable with the little money he earns stays the same. 3. Rich people focus on investing. We all know the famous billionaire investor, Warren Buffet, who made a fortune from a portfolio of investments. If you also research other top billionaires you'd see the number of different investments they have made. If you plan on saving your money and not investing it in worthwhile investments, then you will never be rich. Say for example you make 100k every year, and you leave your money in the bank. You need to save all the money you will earn in the next 10 years just to become a millionaire. And even that doesn't guarantee you will be rich, because after inflation and other emergencies, you might never reach the million mark. That is why I strongly disagree with you save all your earnings in the bank. Instead, you could budget some of your money to educating yourself on how to improve your service, focus on creating another source of income, or make more income streams. Saving is not an income stream. It is a delayed expense. If you don't do anything with your savings, then your money loses its value while sitting in the bank is worth as much as the fat on your belly. Getting fat is also saving. 4. Rich people create multiple income flows. The more money you have, the easier it is to make more money. And one of the fastest ways of making more money is to have multiple income streams. The rich don't depend on one source of income due to unforeseen circumstances. By having multiple streams of income, the rich remain wealthy and use the excess income to invest in new income flows. This is majorly the primary way the rich remain rich. Understand that there are two basic forms of income, active income, which is the money earned from your daily work and passive income which is the payment that comes from an asset that you own or service you render that brings in a steady flow of income. Passive income includes rental property, dividend stocks, index funds, writing a book, or creating an app. 5. Rich people take responsibility for their own failures. For poor people, there's always someone to blame for their shortcomings. They don't own up to their mistakes and never learn from the mistakes. This is what differentiates the rich from the poor. Rich people take up the responsibility for their own failures and use it to learn how to become better and improve what they are doing. In doing so, they improve the results that they can accomplish. And in turn, improve their own self-worth. This also results in them making more money after learning from their mistakes. But the poor blame their failures on everything from the government to a faulty car or damaged phone or the bus. The poor give excuses like, the economy is bad and my boss doesn't like me, or the government screwed things up. Excuses are nothing more than excuses, they do not fix the problem, but rather put the blame on other people. The rich know if their life is a complete mess, it's their fault, not anyone else's. That's why you'll see the poor keep blaming someone for their shortcomings while the rich take responsibility for their actions. 6. Rich people learn continuously. Rich people keep on learning because they know more knowledge brings more opportunities. 
they need to know how to improve themselves so they can make fewer mistakes. Poor people think they are perfect and don't need to know more. And it's this mindset that makes them remain poor without improving on themselves. Rich people know they are not perfect, and they are not trying to become perfect. They need to become better not perfect. They know that they are still far from being perfect because no matter what there will still be something they don't know. And it's this thirst for knowledge that drives the rich to learn new things so as to keep improving every day. Poor people like to talk and make false claims. They like to tell the world their opinion instead of working on improving themselves. Poor people always try to change the world so the world can be perfect for them. They believe since they themselves are perfect, they know it all and are not willing to develop their knowledge. Poor people talk about changing things while they don't even know how current things work. Rich people listen to the world. They know the world changes and continue to learn to keep up with the trends. The world is far smarter than any single human. It is a source of knowledge, and there is no point in changing the world as the world probably will always be smarter, and this is what poor people fail to understand. If you try to change the world instead of yourself, you will stop learning and stop improving. 7. Rich people network with other rich people. Wealthy people understand the importance of surrounding themselves with other successful people, and this is a trait that every person who wants to become rich must develop. Instead of gathering around people who spend most of their time doing frivolous activities, the rich network with others who are wealthy but also have the drive, talent, and, most importantly the potential to become successful. The rich spend time every month getting to know other like-minded people at conferences, events, and gatherings, or just grabbing coffee or a drink with an ambitious person. This is time wisely invested, as it keeps their minds focused on success and helps them meet new people who have fresh and thought-provoking ideas. The poor keep moving about with people who have nothing to offer them and wonder why they remain poor. 8. Rich people have an action mentality. Rich people do not wait before taking action, as they are always proactive and take action. They know they own their destiny, and becoming rich depends on their hard work. Poor people need someone or something else to make them rich. Poor people believe luck makes people rich and not their hard work. Also, poor people like to gamble for success and try their luck with the lottery. The rich otherwise make a plan with detailed steps on what they need to do to get what they want. They leave nothing to chance and own their own fortune. They don't have to ask anybody for permission to do something with their life. They take actions every day towards achieving their desired goal. 9. Rich people take calculated risks. The rich don't rush before they make financial decisions, they do what they can to mitigate risk. Before they put their hard-earned money into a business, they do their research and analysis to determine which options best suit their financial needs and business desires. They make financial decisions by asking themselves questions about a new business venture or plan and seek advice when necessary. Poor people rush into quick money schemes without doing their research, they fall prey to following the crowd and unlike rich people, they fail to avoid frivolous risks that aren't really going to benefit them. 10. Rich people get paid based on results. Poor work hard and earn more money for their boss, the poor think of how better he can serve his boss, instead of looking for new ways of improving his skills to become a better person. The rich know that to become rich, you need to work for yourself first and pay yourself first. That's why the rich keep working on improving themselves because the rich understand the essence of value, which means if you create mediocre products, you earn mediocre profits. All the big billionaires started this way, from Bill Gates, Jeff Bezos, Elon Musk, and so on started this way. As long as you are delivering high quality service and being proactive, you become high value and once you become high value you get a results. Thank you.